The scorpion, a perfect predator. It is silent, fast, and deadly. The poison in its tail can kill a man. But not even the scorpion is totally safe from harm. In a fertile valley in the mountains, various nomadic tribes ceased their wanderings and established the kingdom of Akkad. The Akkadians train under the eyes of King Ornhet to learn the arts of combat. One day, they will take the test that will prove their worth as assassins. Today, one among their number will face this test. Let me help you to your feet, brother. A man named Matthias. He planted you in the dirt, Rama. You stood in front of the sun. I couldn't see. Matthias used a valid strategy. It defeated you, didn't it? I suppose. But it's the very first time. You'll have to do better to pass your test today, Matthias. Don't worry about me. I've had all the training I can stomach. I want to get out there in the real world, and this test won't get me. Don't be so sure! <laughs> you must be alert at all times to be an assassin. If you lose concentration, even for a second, it will get you All right, killed. all right. You've made your point. Now the king wants to see you when you finish your preparations. Keep practicing, and meet us at the top of the village when you're Let's ready. Let's go, Jessup. So, Matthias, you think you're ready to take on the test? Whatever the king wants, I'm up to the challenge. Oh, not so fast. Beat both of us, then you'll be fit to see the king. So be it. Oh, he defeated us both, Ah, uh, Yes, his skill is great. Matthias, the king awaits you inside. King Ermet, I come to begin my test. Rise, Matthias. You have worked hard for this day. Now I lay my task before you. I am ready, my king. To the south of here lies the market town of Kemet. Three days ago, the lord of the town foully murdered one of the palace concubines. Fearing for their lives, the girl sisters have asked for the help of the Acadians. I send you, Matthias. You will enter Kemet by night. Once inside, you will make your way into the palace and find the Lord in his bedchambers. There you will dispense justice. I understand, King Ermet. Live free, Matthias. Die well, my king.
It's him! The Acadian we sent for! Our request is answered! You are the ones who sent to my king for help. Yes, we must avenge the death of our sister. Where is your lord? He is asleep in his chamber upstairs. You can reach it through his private quarters on the other side of the palace. We'll distract the guards. Good luck. <laughs> luck doesn't come in. Congratulations, Acadian! Who's there? What's the meaning of this? My name is Magus. I've been searching for a man of your talent to assist me. I'm conducting an experiment and need a man of strength such as yours, if my work is to be successful. Searching for him? You set this up? You brought that beast that killed the Lord of Kemet? You killed the concubine to lure me here? The concubine is of no importance, my friend. Join me, Acadian. Whatever you are planning is evil, Sorcerer. You want no part of such deeds. How disappointing. And after all my preparation. Take him away to my... Oh. At last! Who are you? You are Acadian, but you've lost your manners when speaking to your elders. Look, I apologize. I am Matthias. And I am Hammett, an old man imprisoned here for almost as long as he can remember. I presume you ran across my old rival, Magus. Your rival? Magus? Yes, I remember. He set a trap for me. Mm. He did the same to me long ago. We were colleagues, he and I. But when I refused to follow him in his dark ways and vowed to fight him, he locked me away here, out of harm's way. Now I have grown old, while he is still young. How? He is allied with the forces of darkness, my Acadian friend. He does their bidding, and they reward him with youth and power, while the likes of us rot and wither in his dungeon. Well, I'm not rotting here until I'm as old as you, old man. has come down upon your people. I must help them. I'm afraid you're too late, my friend. <sighs> Matthias. Matthias, the king. You must protect me. King. <sighs> Rama. Uh, I'm okay, Matthias. Where's King Ermet? 
Jessup took him. Go to the Matthias. You're the last of us. Last? Go! Protect the king! Try to stay awake, my king. Matthias. Matthias, you are alive, my brother. It may have been better if I were not. What do you mean? This is not your doing, Matthias. We were taken by surprise. By troops from Kemet. They were not from Kemet, my king. They were sent by a sorcerer named Magus, who set a trap for us. I was betrayed and captured. I'm sorry I did not get here sooner. You would have been slain too, if you had. And now, King Hermat. No. Matthias, you must avenge us. Magus is too powerful, Acadian. Even your skills cannot defeat him. He is allied with the Netherworld. There must be a way, old man. Now tell me what you know. Magus is protected by dark lords of the Netherworld. Only their own power can be used against him. I'm no sorcerer. There is a legend of a sword owned by the god Osiris and used by his own brother to kill him. Magus fears this sword, for it is the only thing that can stop his plans. You must find it. How do I do that? Across the sea to the north, there is an island upon which a great city stands. Below this city, is an ancient chamber where legends say the sword is kept, guarded by strange beasts. Find the chamber, and you will find the sword. I shall avenge our people. Goes there. My name is Matthias. I was shipwrecked here. What has happened here? An earthquake? A beast. The bullheaded one itself has come to our island. A bullheaded beast? The very ground shook with the step of its mighty hooves. Our buildings began to topple. Our people ran. But many of us stayed to fight. We have the beast trapped in the tomb, but it still shakes our island. Take me to this beast. I must see it. What? Many of our men died to lock it up. We can't let you in there. I can look after myself. I'm not worried about you, but the beast mustn't get loose again. Don't worry. It won't get loose. We can't risk you opening the tomb. Leave our island or face the consequences. My quest doesn't involve you, Manoan. But if I must fight you, I will.
Not another of those creatures. Definitely not another of those creatures. Your journey is long, mortal. But I will help you for your purposes to my liking. The last two shards wait for you in the realm of the Snake God. Step through the portal and I will take you there. The realm of the Snake God? Is there nowhere pleasant in this network? Let me pass. I have no time for you. You are one of the living. What are you doing here? The Netherworld is not a place for mortals. Then get out of my way and I shall leave you. Not so fast, human. I am Apep, the Snake God, guardian of the gates to the land of the living. No mortal that steps in the Netherworld is permitted to return to the lands above. If you insist on attempting escape, I have no choice but to force you to stay. Damn you, human! If you ever return here, I'll have your soul! If I ever return here, I'll have your apology.
Hammett. Matthias, you are alive. You have to stop getting captured, old man. It's not just me, Acadian. Your brothers were also taken. What? <coughs> Major still had troops in the mountains near your village, and they captured Jessup and Rama shortly after you left them. Magus has your two brothers. And now, he has you. Jessup, Rama. They cannot hear you, Acadian. They are in an enchanted sleep and will awake only when my ritual is complete. But I wanted you to witness that which you have helped to accomplish. I needed a man of your strength to enter the netherworld and retrieve the sword of Osiris. When you refused my request in Kemet, I had to resort to other means of employing your services. I took the form of an old prisoner and fed your thirst for revenge. You killed my people! Well, yes! Their deaths allowed me to manipulate your every move. You're such a useful tool, don't you agree? Damn you. Why involve others? Why can't you do your own dirty work? Ah, my friend. If I were to venture into the netherworld, my dark masters would claim my soul. I would be unable to return. You, on the other hand, had no right to be there. You would find a way out, once you had found the Sword of Osiris for me. I was warned not to let that sword into the hands of people like you. I will summon Set, the great Chaos God, who slew his brother Osiris with this very weapon. With Set's power and the beast armies of the Netherworld, I will enslave or destroy the people of the Land of the Living and rule this whole world. And you and your brothers will be my first sacrifice. No! Your evil is at an end, sorcerer. <laughs> Congratulations, Matthias. Again, you have unwittingly helped me to complete my plans. What are you talking about? In order to become the Chaos God, one more sacrifice is needed. <coughs> it is necessary for the summoner to die by his enemy's hand. Thank you, Arcadian. Now I can take the power <coughs> of the netherworld into myself.